G'day guys, Carl Jockamson here. I'm back in Australia and uh, I've made it to the Daiwa Hobie Bass Grand Final. I'm um, here with the champion angler, Richard Summerton. And, uh, you know, I know what it's like to win tournaments. the best feeling in the whole world. It's what we, you know, thousands of people chase and uh, you've done it here this weekend. And the question, you know, a lot of people want to know is how'd you, how'd you do it? And let us know a few of the techniques and lures. Yeah, uh, no worries. Uh, first day yesterday, uh, we had a session about six hours. Um, I just went up. Uh, hit a bank, tried a bit of surface early yep. uh, with a little Mazzy pop, ended up pulling a 38, uh, just waking it just underneath the surface. Uh, I thought, okay, here we go, and then continued doing that, went quiet probably for the next 20 minutes, half an hour. Then moved down onto a point, just picked up a spinner bait and fired it out, uh, whacked a fish, went, okay, then that was another one for the bag. Uh, got another couple small fish and then uh, got another legal and that was a bag done by about 20 past 8 that morning So then I could start looking for upgrades. So that was pretty good. Nice. The, um, I saw you had, you had your biggest fish yesterday And then you kind of backed it up. You only had two hours yesterday afternoon to get it done. How, how yeah, did that, was, how did that uh, happen? Yeah, yeah, two hours of power. Yeah, um, yeah so I'll pull after that. On that first session I went to a bay and found some fish uh, Got a nice 46 and a couple of other up upgraded all my earlier fish uh, I thought okay then they're still here. Oh, no, I left them biting and just got out of there because I knew we had that two hours to go, and it's a bit, it's a bit of a bit of a trip up the uh, up the lake to it, 20, 20 odd minutes, 25 minutes. So uh, we came back, and as soon as they said go, I powered straight there. Probably took me uh, uh, 10 minutes before I got the first fish, was which was a uh, small fish. And I started to get a little bit jittery, looking at the Lawrence the whole time, just watching the clock tick down, and uh, and then bang, just got them. I uh, got a couple of got my three legals. I thought, okay, that'll do. That's a that'll do for now. And I'll fire it one more cast. Bang, got another upgrade. And I thought, I've nice. definitely got to go now. Yeah. So I just got the hell out of there and powered back here. And actually, I just came in half an hour earlier. Okay. And you know, the required time. Yeah, it looks like you really got it done this time. So <laughs> it's nice to know that uh, you you probably couldn't be caught after you caught that nice last upgrade. Yeah, yeah, it was good. I got a couple of nice forty sixes, so it was uh, quite good. And then today. Uh, yeah, it was the big hoodoo for me because I've had a few bad second days lately. So uh, went out, uh, got a fish, well, probably pretty much third cast, I think. That's uh, the way to get it started. Yeah, and I thought, here we go, here we go. And then nothing but small fish, small fish, small fish, 29.5s, 29.9s, just so they wouldn't measure. And then uh, I heard a bit of yahooing from uh, Brownie and further up the lake. And I'm going, oh, yeah. And then uh, I kept on catching small fish because I knew that area didn't fight in the afternoon so I wasn't okay. overly concerned and then Scotty Baker came down and asked him how we went and he said I'm, I'm getting plenty of fish everyone's still catching there and I went okay I'll go up so I went up caught probably half a dozen casts got got my bag yeah and then went back to the back down the lake again into that arm and just waited for the afternoon session where I upgraded them all again is there a particular lure that was catching the bigger fish? Because you you obviously had, I think, four over 40, which not many anglers had. Is there one lure that was getting no, the job done? not or? really. I, oh, day one, it was, um, I think, the, the one of the 46s came on a uh, spinnerbait. Another one came on a beetle spin. Yep. Which I thought, oh, I hadn't thrown that day. I'll give it a go. I wanted to a point and pull a 46 off it. Um, and then 10, uh, 60s and brown dog. Yeah. Um, they were all pretty much, the only... I didn't catch a fish on where I tied on my lures. It was a blade, really. I did a bit of blading, but couldn't pick up a fish. So, and the top water, top water, just not much. No, early. with a drawdown on the lake, I think they're just they're not there. They're just they're just off the weed bed, just just down in that four meters. Okay, they seem to be sitting there. And I was telling the boys just stay in four meters. Like yeah. the guys I travelled up with from Victoria, and that I was just staying in the four meters. And then today they went out and they just did exactly what I said, and they got into they them got as well. Them. Okay. Yeah. Well, well done. So that's, there, you, there you have it. There's uh, your champion angler for the Daiwa Hobie Kayak Bass Series. And uh, congratulations and Thanks, good job. Thanks.